So it's Brogeria preparing to serve on this, the Volleyball Nations League bow. Nice dig by the Libro to keep Bulgaria in the point. But it's Japan, who despite receiving serve, found themselves in control of that opening point. After the scrambling dig was saved by Jana Tadarova. They lead 1-0. Very cleverly placed to tie the score at one point apiece. Delicate touch off the high leap from Nasia Dimitrova. Finding the space between the cluster of Japanese defenders. All square, one point apiece, but an unforced error. Sending the ball into the net. Slava Paskova unable to find a range. So it's Japan with the serve leading 2 1. Terrific dig from Ishii. Oh, what a block at the net! It was a cat tandem of Ishii and Okumura who came together to make an impenetrable wall. See Japan go up 3-1. Oh, sensational hitting from the outside. Powering that spike into vacant space was Simona Dimitrova. Perfectly set and no mistake with the put away. So Bulgaria tie things up. Three points apiece. Looking for their first lead of the match. Nasya Dimitrova with the serve. And the attempted kill has drifted outside of the sidelines. And it's Bulgaria who take the lead for the first time. On a run of three unanswered points to edge ahead on the scoreboard. Nice save in the backcourt, but the touch of the net, or the double touch, excuse me, sees Japan tie things up at four. Terrific dig from a high-speed spike from the Japanese libero. Kobata. Ishii called into action, may come into the net for the kill, and she provides the point-winning play. Heavily involved during the course of that point, the longest rally of the match so far. And it's Japan who take it to edge ahead by one. So Miyu Nakagawa, the youngest player on the team, Terrific serve, but that's an awkward reception from Todorova. Change of tempo with the touch over on the second touch, the second contact. But the attempted block drifts beyond the confines of the court, so we're all square at five. So Simona Dimitrova preparing to serve. Oh, the reverse set was a beauty and what a put away. Executed efficiently by Mai Okamura. Adding 
plenty of space between those Bulgarian defenders. Oh, that's a clever placement. Scrambling save was affected by Ishii. Now, Bulgaria being pushed up all over the court. Terrific reflexes, but no control, ultimately, on the attempt to dig from Miwako Asanai. And it's Bulgaria who get back to level terms. So a jump spike serve. Fired over. What a reach from the server, but there was no control from from Gagina Dimitrova. Now it's Japan who looked to trigger the first technical timeout. They have a one-point lead. So Okamura serves. But it's a service error from Okamura to the delight of the Young local supporters of the home team. So who will bring up the eight-point total first? Bulgaria still in search of their first lead of the match in the early stages of this first set. Oh, terrific put away. The acute angle on the hit from Austinite. See so Japan trigger the first technical timeout with a one-point lead. 8-7 through the opening exchanges of this first set. Okumi Nakada, Japanese coach. And it's a carnival atmosphere at the Mombat Arena. And in the early stages of this opening set, Bulgaria still very much in this contest. Tied things up on a few occasions, but have never managed to tilt the scoreboard with a lead in their favour. They're currently trailing by one. Sato with the serve. Terrific hitting down the sideline. Bulgaria even things up once again. Over with the serve. Ball still alive. What reflexes at the net, but no, that is too many contacts. And Bulgaria with their first take their first lead of the game. So Laura Kitipova with the serve. Nice dig in the backcourt from Ishii. Cleverly placed. Now there was contact on the ground despite the efforts of Shinobi. Excuse me, it was Kabata the Libro who made the despairing dive. Ultimately it was in vain. She thought she got a hand beneath the basket between the court and the ball, but not on this occasion. So Bulgaria, four points without reply, prompts Japan to call a timeout. They're trailing by three, having been held scoreless since the resumption of play after the first technical timeout when they led eight points to seven.
So the semaphore setting the tactics. The Libero with the reception. Oh, what a save by her opposite number. And forceful hitting down the sideline, producing the point. Terrific put away by Ishii. Now it's Japan's turn to set the strategy. And I prepares to serve. Oh, that is an absolute rocket. Terrific save. What hustle from Japan. My goodness. You have got to admire the tenacity of Mako Kabata. What a turnaround from Bulgaria because that saw them in all kinds of trouble. But look at Kabata go hurtling after that one. And again, the jump spike serve. That's well judged by Japan. Nice save by the Bulgarian Libero. Oh, the deflection. Finding the open court. Terrific hit. And the attempted block from Japan ultimately in vain. Asanai unable to run that one down. So it's Nasia Dimitrova with the serve. Effective dig in the backcourt, then called into action with the backcourt spike. Japan able to defend. Terrific hitting. And Nasia Dimitrova unable to dig this one out. The high speed spike sent down at high speed from Yuki Ishii. Nakagawa, the 19-year-old, with the serve. Over on the second contact, Japan are being stretched. They have to push it over on the third touch. And as they were disorganized and poured all over the court, that was easy pickings for Bulgaria. That push over on the second contact really did catch Japan by surprise. And as a result, the defenses weren't set. That those spaces were exploited and capitalized upon by Bulgaria. Diving save from Asanai. What a save from the Libra on the other side of the net. Todder over with the reach, but the point goes Japan's way to reduce the arrears to two. Ishii with the serve. Terrific save by Kabata. Fantastic dig out by the Libero. Ultimately, the point has gone in Bulgaria's direction. A mega rally indeed. But it's Bulgaria who prevailed. 
Just some terrific defending during the course of that point. The Libros were caught into action on more than a few occasions. Near the conclusion of what was a lengthy exchange indeed. So a combination of Todorova and Kitova. Kitipova, Kitipova coming together at the net. Now is that long? Yes it is. So it's Bulgaria who bring about technical timeout number two by with it with a four-point advantage, but a challenge has been launched by Japan. Inquiring as to whether there was a touch on the block to take that ball out of the bound out of bounds. Perhaps that challenge launched in hope rather than expectation because you can see there is clear daylight between Kitipova and the ball. So the technical timeout has been reached and it's Bulgaria who trigger this intermission with a four-point advantage. So Gagarano with the Dimitrova with the serve, ball dancing around on the tape of the net. And the backcourt spike deflected out of bounds. To see Japan take the point to close the gap to three. That's his game for the first time, Yuri Nabea. 25 years of age and among the highest leapers on the Japanese team with a spike height reach of 305 centimeters, just two centimeters lower than Nakagawa. And it's a positive contribution. But the point that Japan feel they have claimed has been challenged by Bulgaria. So we'll call upon Hawkeye once again to get the official verdict. So the resumption sees Japan close the gap to one. Bulgaria electing to call timeout.
so since the technical timeout number two and Bulgaria led by four points Japan have rattled off three points without reply to get back to within one the last time we had a one-point match was at 9-8 to Bulgaria oh what a put away terrific hitting Mira Todorova firing that one down at a really steep angle. Watch the running room. Finding the space between the barricade that the Japanese blockers attempted to erect. She's serving now. Clever touch to keep the point alive for Japan. Get it over on the third contact. Oh, what a reach from Jana Todorova. Jana Todorova, the Libro, called into action once again. Double contact. Sees Japan tie things up at 17 points apiece. Quick reactions from the Japanese Libro, then a... Getting over change of rhythm with Bulgaria, getting it over on the first contact. Terrific save by Jana Todor over the Bulgarian Libro once again. Now the ball is in play, or at least in the bounds of the court, and that means it's point to Bulgaria to give them a one-point lead, but look at that for a save from Jana Todor over. And wonderful placement from Gagada... Gargana Dimitrova. So Japan tied the score at 18. Fantastic save by the Bulgarian Libro once again. And how about that for a save in deep in the backcourt from Austinai? But ultimately the put away. An effective one from Bulgaria. Flying high to whip over that arm. There's Paskova. She's preparing for a jump spike serve now. My goodness, that is such a deadly weapon, an ace from the cannon of an arm from Miroslava Paskova. She was the athlete who provided the previous point on the spike, which gave Bulgaria the serve. And then look at this. Zipping over the net and dipping dramatically. For an ace from the unplayable serve of Paskova. Japan call timeout facing a two point deficit. So Paskova with the serve. That's a 
fantastic put away. Sato with a clean kill to bring her team back to within one. Well, the bump sails out of bounds. And uh, Iwasaka unable to control the contact in the face of this powerful spike from Gagana Dimitrova. Oh, what a block at the net. And it's that athlete again, Gagana Dimitrova who timed her leap to perfection, and look at the penetration she gets over the net to kill that attempted spike, dead. A monster block indeed. So Japan with the improvisation, they get it over on his third time, and that high-speed spike puts Nasha Dimitrov under pressure as they then Kitipova was placed under heavy pressure by the follow-up spike. Well, Bulgaria being stretched here. And ultimately, the defense is breached. Significant pressure applied by Japan throughout the course of that point, always appearing to have Bulgaria on the ropes. Some terrific defending was in evidence from Bulgaria. Reaction dig from Nasha Dimitrova. And another one from Kitipova. And still, Bulgaria continue to battle to try and keep themselves in this point. Ultimately, unable to control the contact was Mira Todorova. And it's Japan who closed to within two at the conclusion of that lengthy rally. So Japan back to within one deep into this opening set. Oh, that's fantastic blocking at the net. Okamura and Sato combining to come up with the kill that ties the score at 22 points apiece. Watch the tandem here. Timing their leap in synchronized fashion. And putting up a barricade that was unbreachable. So deep into this opening set. Japan currently on a run of three unanswered points, which has seen, which has seen them tie things up at 22. Who will arrive at the set point first? That's long. And it's Japan. Well, coming correct in the closing stages of this first set. Bulgaria launching a challenge, inquiring as to whether there was a touch on the block.
there's official confirmation that there was no touch so the challenge from bulgaria an unsuccessful one japan looked to bring up set points having rattled off four straight points Oh, that's a clever play on the adjustment, nudged over by the Libero. Now, it's out of bounds. The Japanese defences appear to be stretched, but the placement of the put away was inaccurate. Plenty of time, seemingly, for... Simona Dimitrova to pick her spot, but she could only put it wide. Set point to Japan. Well, communication difficult for the Japanese side in this noisy and raucous atmosphere at the Mombad Arena. The tactics finally set and the serve in play. Oh, terrific defending. Coming up big at the net with a towering block is Mira Todorova. Timed her leap to perfection. Watch the court that she covers there. And then able to pivot in midair and steer it down with the left hand. So Japan unable to take the set on their first set point that they created. Bulgaria bring to an end the run of five unanswered points that they were subjected to. And it's Simona Dimitrova preparing to serve. Still facing set points. Oh, and it's taken on the second opportunity, a terrific kill from Yuki Ishii. Sees Japan take the first set by a two-point margin. Competitive back and forth opening set between these two. Plenty of shifts in momentum, plenty of lead changes as well. And at the second time of asking, it is Japan who closed out the set point opportunity that they created to take a one set to nothing lead. Well, it took around 34 minutes to conclude that opening set. And there were some terrific highlights from both teams Plenty of mon mega rallies, lots of monster blocks, and some outstanding portaways. Of what was some really entertaining fare. How about that for the kill at the net from Nasia Dimitrova? But Japan came up with plenty of big plays of their own. Okamura with four points in the opening set. about this for Hustle from the Japanese team in vain on that occasion. But the togetherness and the intensity evident throughout the course of the opening set from both teams. How about that for placement from Gergana Dimitrova. Five points in the opening set for her, the joint leading scorer, excuse me, this leading scorer not just on her team, but in the entire match so far. So Bulgaria competing admirably in the first set of this, the VNL debut. But they'll be looking to even this thing up as quickly as possible and avoid going two sets to nothing down, which would mean they would have to force a five-set game, five-set match, if they were to looking to come away with a win on their VNL bow.
Oh, popcorn at the ready for that youngster. This is action-packed fair indeed. So second set underway. And it's Japan who take the first point. Oh, well, everybody was foxed by that set, which was rather ballooned. The leap mistimed, and the ball was still going up as the spiker was coming back down to earth. Out of sync on that particular setup. Fantastic serve stretches Bulgaria. A high bump from the Libra. Now Japan with time to set up a big backcourt spike and there was no mistake with that put away. Brilliant start to the second set by Japan. Ishii flying in from beyond that backcourt line to make it 3-0. A service error from the hand of Sato. Gives Bulgaria their first point on the board in this second set. So here comes the cannon. And again, it stretches the Japanese defenses, but they recover well. Terrific recovery. The Libro bumps it over. Oh, now which side of the line is that? It's on the right side of the line from Bulgaria's perspective. And they close the deficit to one. But Japan, with some terrific defending during the course of that point, Put away an effective one from Simona Dimitrova. So it's point Japan to extend their lead to two. Service error from Iwako Asana Asanai. So looking to tie. Nasia Dimitrova serve. But they can't get it over with the three contacts in this Japan. Will have the serve once again in a two point lead. So Iwasaka with the serve. It's a game of back and forth in the early stages of this second set. Neither team able to hold on to their serve to stitch a run of points together. Spike an effective one by Simona Dimitrova. That was well watched by Japan. Terrific reflexes. And now it's Bulgaria who are stretched. They have to get it over on this contact. They do so. Nice block on the dig by Osanai. 
And they come away with the point. To edge ahead by two. It remains a back and forth affair. Ishii with the kill. Bulgaria were unable to deal with at the block. by it from Japan. Terrific timing on the lead off the two-footed plant. Oh, wonderful placement on that spike. What hitting on the run around. Okamura with the kill to move to four points in the game. At the technical timeout, it is Japan who lead by three in this second set. Scorer in this game so far is Yuki Ishii. Twenty-eight year old. One of the highest leapers on the team in terms of spike height. And she's used that attribute well to come up with some terrific kills at the net for Japan. Evidence of her prowess, that accurate spike down the sideline and a towering backcourt spike on, spike on that occasion from the game's leading scorer so far, bisecting the attempt to double block perfectly. Seven points in the game for her so far. Oh, and the attempted spike is wide. the placement of that attempt to put away. Bulgaria serving down by two. a challenge after that point was awarded to Japan. in fact been touched so the challenge an effective one and it is Bulgaria who will serve so you just have to wait for everything to be adjusted after that successful challenge where Hawkeye confirmed a touch Reiterate that point should be six eight rather than six nine. 
to get everything back into sync. Well, Japan was celebrating as Bulgaria demonstrated their soccer skills. So now the score will be 6-9 after Japan take this point after Bulgaria launched a successful challenge on the previous point. So just a pause in play while, while all of the clocks and scoreboards are placed in, placed in sync because we've just got a little bit of a problem with the official scoreboard and the equipment at the official's table who are doing the scoring here. It's an incredibly quick sport, of course. Things happen in a hurry. And of course, the officials have to ensure that everything is correct. So once the discrepancy is resolved, the action will resume. Here in the second set at the Mombat Arena. Well, the fans having a wonderful time here. They saw, they saw a highly competitive first set and they're hoping that this enthusiastic support will be enough to see Bulgaria take the lead to tie things up at one. All of that relatively long way away just emerged from the eight point technical timeout and it's Japan with a three point advantage. So Bulgaria are launching a challenge regarding an attack line fault. So Hawkeye being called into action once again. And here's the review. Oh, now you can see the daylight. So there's no fault because that was indeed backcourt spike didn't breach the line to stray into the front court and after that lengthy interruption the action will resume and it is Japan who are leading by three oh that's a fantastic kill put away cleanly by Miroslava Paskova. Given running room. Flying high, Paskova. For powering that one down. So, Katipova. Area back to within one off the Kapitova serve. Desperate attempt from Japan to extend the point, but unable to get it over the net. So we are all square, nine points apiece. Pecha Barakova.
Terrific save in the backcourt by Nakagawa. Point is still alive. But ultimately, it's Japan who have their defences breached, and that sees Bulgaria take the lead. That prompts Japan to call timeout. Bulgaria ahead for the first time in this second set. They've put together four points without reply to take this one-point advantage. Clean kill from Simona Dimitrova. Seven points in the match for her so far. She leads her team in scoring. And has been crucial in tilting the momentum in their favor. So Barakova with the serve, but it's a service error. Which sees them seed serve. And Japan tie things up at 10. <laughs> Terrific reception by the Libero, Kobata. Oh, and what a block at the net. Soaring high and demonstrating strong wrists. As Miroslava Paskova. So, service error. Sees the score tied up at 11 points apiece this second set. Well, Bulgaria were placed on the rack there. And ultimately, it is Japan who take the point to edge ahead by one. The Arsenai serve. See Japan take another point. The illegal contact by Bulgaria. They take time out. Japan rattling off three straight points to lead by two in the second set. Scrambling reception by the Libero. Keeps Bulgaria in the point, but they were stretched all over the court. And Japan found the space in the porous Bulgarian defense after they were really extended on the first serve. Four points without reply now. with five points in the match so far. Oh, 
what a hit. My goodness, that had some force behind it from Barakova. Excuse me. It wasn't Barakova who put, provided the kill. It was, in fact, Nasia Dimitrova. To move to four points in the game. So the dig from Barakova. Oh, and it's come up with a point, or perhaps an unlikely point, given the state of the rally. But Gargana Dimitrova with the point to bring Bulgaria back to within one. Oh, wonderful placement on that kill from Yuki Ishii. Yuki Ishii moves to nine points in the match so far. Japan lead by two. And once again, back-to-back -back points for Bulgaria from Gargana Dimitrova from around that same angle. And once again, it's skidding across the attempted block of the Japanese duo at the net. And Yuki Ishii Find the space down the sideline to trigger the second technical timeout. Japan leading by two. So Japan looking to build on a two-point lead in what has been a very close second set so far. <laughs> Terrific hitting from Bulgaria. Mira Todorova with the put away. Three points in the game for her now. She reduces the arrears faced by her team to just one. It was an effective one from Paskova. What a save from the Libero. Wonderful hitting. Coming around on the curl was Okamura. Set perfectly. Bulgaria's defense has pulled asunder and she was able to find the space despite the despairing dive of Karakasheva. Touched out of bounds. So Bulgaria remain within touching distance. Spike repelled at the net by Bulgaria. Terrific timing on the block to produce the monster block and a point-winning play to tie things up at 17. Terrific timing from Nasha Dimitrova 
And we are all square deep into set number two. Five points in the game now for Nasir Dimitrova. Oh, well, Bulgaria pulled all over the place and ultimately Paskova couldn't control the spike that came in her direction. But prior to that, there was some fantastic defending from Bulgaria to extend the point. So Yuri Nabea with the serve. It's the first one. Oh, the second contact putting it over, just almost catching out Japan. And ultimately, that change in tempo and rhythm put Bulgaria in an advantageous position. And they did not hesitate to close it out. So we are all square. 18 all in the second set. Very cleverly played. Very deft touch at the net. To see Japan take the lead. a terrific put away my goodness that came down with some velocity Maria Karakashkova fantastic finish to tie things up at 19 Bulgaria looking for their first lead of this second set since the score was 11-10 midway through and they have got it by going 20 points to 19. So Japan calling time out as we edge closer, closer towards the finishing post of set number two. They're trying to stem this momentum that Bulgaria have built up on the back of consecutive spectacular plays. Bulgaria building up ahead of steam over the past couple of points to go ahead by one. Lead for the first time since it was since the middle point of this second set. And the point goes to Bulgaria. Japan unable to control the direction of the attempted kill. Rising high. There's Nakagawa, but she couldn't control where her placement went. Over on the second contact, but the point has been awarded to Japan. Close the arrears to just one point deep into set number two. So, Austin I with the serve. Seven points in the match so far. Second leading scorer for her team. Fantastic hitting once again. Gargana Dimitrova her team up by two and edging closer to arriving at set points eight points in the match now for Gagana Dimitrova and that her seventh clean kill
Oh, and it's completely Fox Japan. The delicate touch. She's demonstrated her force on the previous putaways, but on this occasion, gave herself running room. The set perfectly placed, and look at that. Kabata not able to close down and put in a dive. Now looking for set points. But Japan are going to make Bulgaria work for it. You'd expect nothing less from a team who enjoyed so many five-set victories in the first year of VNL play. They don't know when they are beaten. Oh, what a finish at the net. And it brings up set points in set number two as Bulgaria look to tie up this match at one set apiece. Once again, here's Gorgana Dimitrova. He's putting the fans in ecstasy here. And they have closed out the set at the first time of asking capitalizing on the first set point opportunity that they built and they take the second set by a scoreline of 25 points to 21 to tie things up at one set apiece to the delight of their home fans here at the Monbad Arena. So, confirmation of the scoreline in the second set, where Bulgaria built some terrific momentum late on, taking the lead at 20 points to 19. And after that, they never let Japan regain the advantage. Ultimately closed it out. The first time of asking after securing set points, and it is they who go into set number three with their tails up. So we're all square, one set apiece. After an hour and ten minutes of play here at the Monbat Arena. Both teams still showing plenty of spirit to their opponents on the other side of the net. They're still together, they're still unified. It's Bulgaria, who will begin set number three with the serve. Barakova preparing to serve. Two points in the game so far. One of them coming on an ace. So the third set then, about to get underway. Terrific hitting at the net, and it's Bulgaria who take the opening point of the third set. Oh, 
Oh, well, that is a terrific turnaround. Because Japan appeared to be on the ropes during the course of that point after the effective serve from Barakova. Miyu Nakagawa over to provide the point winning play. Six points in the match for her so far. 1 0. over on the first contact. Oh, that is terrific hitting. Karakashova. Terrifically quick arm. And over the top of the attempted blockers. Cleverly played by Ishii. Met by a pair of Bulgarian blockers at the net. And just placing it, forcing them to deflect it out of bounds. Oh, an unreturnable serve. First ace of the match for Japan. Sees them take a two-point two point lead. Saka serving then after that ace. That's a difficult one for Bulgaria to deal with, but they recover well. And it's Gargana Dimitrova. Only double digit scorer for her team in this match so far. She's moved to 11. After that, her 10th clean kill. Japan trailing by one. Excuse me. Bulgaria trailing by one. Nasa Dimitra with the serve, and it's Japan who take the point. So Nakagawa serving. Six points in the match so far. Clear communication between Japan, sees them keep that point alive, but what a block at the net, my goodness. A combination of Mira Todorova and Maria Karakasheva combining to brilliant effect to see Bulgaria take the point on the kill block. Fantastic set for the backcourt spike to be put away. You see Japan edge ahead by two. Wonderful set to bring Osanai flying in from behind that line. Seven points in the game for her now. Japan with a two-point lead. Wonderful reactions and the ball, well, the point ultimately has gone Bulgaria's way, but they were celebrating the point already, but they didn't count on the reflexes of Kabata to recover, recover and get that ball over. But it went the wrong side of the court markings from Japan's point of view. Bulgaria back to within one. But it's a short-lived one-point deficit after that put away. Japan regain their two point advantage. So Okamura with the serve. 
And it's an ace for Japan. The second of the match. What a way to bring up the first technical timeout of set number three. Okamura moves to eight points in the game. And Japan lead this third set, eight points to five. Well, Gagana Dimitrova leads her team in scoring. And she has demonstrated some fantastic hitting. The wing spike up, flying in up the sidelines and creating a terrific angle on her kills. On more than one occasion, she's really caused difficulty for the Japanese blockers at the net. And look at that for placement. Dimitrova leading her team in scoring as the sole double digit scorer for Bulgaria to this point. Oh, and is that in or out? No, it's wide because. It was a fantastic recovery from Japan. They were being stretched, but there was fantastic re reflexes demonstrated on the set. But the spike couldn't be controlled. So Japan have launched the challenge, inquiring as to whether this ball is in or out. It appeared to be out by some distance, but what says Hawkeye? Well, maybe the challenge affording the players a little bit of rest. Because that was clearly beyond the confines of the court. Bulgaria with the point, and they're back to within two. So, Tadarova with the serve. Oh, what a clever play. The most delicate touch from Karasha, from Karakasheva. Reaching up high, excuse me, is Nasya Dimitrova, who provided the point winning play to tie things up at eight. And then it's Nasia Dimitrova who is on the spot to provide the block, soaring high. And just look at the reach over the net. Fantastic penetration. Her second point winning block of the match. Make that three to take her to eight points in the match so far. Joint second leading scorer on her team. And Japan have been subjected to four unanswered points, prompting their coach to call timeout. They're trailing by one.
So the point won by Austin I to take her to nine points in the game and tie things up at nine here in set number three. Or oh, no contact at the net. Paskova unable to get the required elevation to keep that one in bound. It's Japan who edge ahead and lead by one. Terrific dig by Ishii. Out of bounds, point Japan. So Nastya Dimitri Dimitrova unable to control the placement of her attempted kill. Bulgaria calling timeout, down by two in this third set. <laughs> Да се използва нашия потенциал като като ръст да чина за за атаката. Нещо, айде, дай, 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 дай сега. Ай. Well, Japan emerged from near timeout which they called when they were 9-8 down. Since that time, they've rattled off three points without reply to lead by two. What will Bulgaria calling timeout result on a resumption for them? The attempted put away is long, points in favor of Japan. Bulgaria were claiming that there was contact at the net and indeed, they are launching a challenge because they're convinced that there was a deflection. Well, the challenge, an effective one, because there's a touch with the index finger by the Japanese blocker. And that means Bulgaria take the point to stem that run of three without reply and close the gap to just one. Preparing to serve is Barakova. Wonderful placement on that cross-court kill. Austin Ike. With another point. Now preparing to serve. Oh, that is delightful from the far side of the court. Finding the gap. With perfect placement was Ishii to take her to 13 points in the match. The game high scorer gives her team a four point lead.
Oh, that is wonderful. What a clever play from Paskova. Demonstrating her incredible leaping ability. Hanging in the air, but not the rocket arm that she uses so effectively on her serve. This time, just cleverly placed. It's Paskova serving now, reducing the speed on the serve. So Dimitrova recovers the serve for Bulgaria. Gagana Dimitrova moves to 12 points in the game with that her 11th clean kill. Slava Paskova unable to control the spike that was hammered in her direction. That sees Japan arrive at the 16 point mark to bring up technical timeout number two. And they do so with a four point advantage, equaling the largest lead of this third set so far. Well, the game very much in the balance through this juncture of two and a half sets of play, and Japan have demonstrated some fantastic defending. Clear communication, quick reflexes, at times desperate dives, but then look at the hustle to keep it alive and extend the point. Nothing a lost cause for the Japanese team. Fantastic court coverage, one of the hallmarks of their play. So it's Nakagawa with the serve. A team leading by four. Oh, and we talked about their blocking and defending prowess and a clear demonstration of it there. Soaring high was Okamura. And it's a five-point lead now, the largest of the game for Japan. Okamura with eight points on the night on her second kill block. And it's Japan were prompting Bulgaria to call a timeout. They are facing their largest deficit of this third set so far. And you don't want Japan to get too far out of sight as we edge ever closer towards the 25-point winning total. Very well put away once more by Gargana Dimitrova. Takes her to 13 points in the game. How Bulgaria would love to string a run of points together here before Japan arrive at the 20 point mark.
terrific save in the backcourt. Well, Austinite came up with a crucial play during the course of that point. It's Ishii with the serve, the game's leading scorer. Oh, terrific hitting. And even a libero of the reflexes of Jana Todorova could do nothing about that one. Running room for Ishii. And that one a case of catch it or wear it for the Bulgarian libero. And it's the momentum tilting Squarely in favor of Japan here in the closing stages. They've got their largest lead of the third set so far. A seven-point advantage. Racing towards the winning total. And there is an example of just how much the momentum has swung in their favor. An unreturnable serve. Ishii with her first ace of the match in her team high total of 16. So now Bulgaria get the serve back, but they are facing a seven point deficit having trailed by as many as eight. So Japan will want to close this one out as quickly as possible. Terrific reach by Gagana Dimitrova and Bulgaria managed to turn it around and close out the point that was squarely against them. Determined defending from Bulgaria throughout the course of that point and how about that for a clever play from the woman who has just checked in, Silvana Chausheva. So on that occasion, Chausheva in the thick of the action once again, but unable to control the block. But Bulgaria challenging the call. And the ball is in. Well, what an impact on this game Chao Shibaru is having. She came up with a clever play on her first contribution off the bench. And now she's come up with a point-winning block. But Japan regained the serve immediately. Chalshiva, a real catalyst off the bench for her team. As Japan looked to, looked to bring up set points. With a six point advantage. Into the game. For the first time. Is Nanami Seki. Oh, that is a terrific put away. And again, Bulgaria making Japan work for this. Running room. And then thundered down by Mira Todorova.
And finding the space in the rear of the court is the Japanese captain, Nana Iwasaka, to bring up set point. Perfectly placed. And now an opportunity. Sato to close out the third set. And they have done it at the first time of asking. Japan takes set number three by a score of 25 points to 19. To go ahead, two sets to one in this pool two matchup on the opening day of VNL 2019. Well, Bulgaria made it interesting. They battled tenaciously. Well, they couldn't get their noses in front on the scoreboard. Since the 9.8 mark, after that, it was Japan who kept themselves in front. Let's take a look at some of the highlights. Well, the fans here have been treated to a terrific spectacle on this, the VNL debut of Bulgaria. Well, they witnessed a victory on this, their maiden appearance. If Bulgaria hopes to come away with a win, they're going to have to force this to a fifth and deciding set. With Japan having taken set number three, and this is how they did it. Slight edge in attack, Bulgaria more effective on the block, but look at that for Japan. All four of their aces in this match coming in the third set. Helped out by Bulgarian errors as well. Inside the numbers of set number three. Bulgaria now playing to extend this match. Worth pointing out that the five set distance Holds no fears for Japan. Three to win over Italy during the round robin phase of the competition last year. And an epic 3 2 win over Thailand. Part of the results as they compiled a 7 and 8 record to finish 10th out of 16 teams in the round robin phase. So the fourth set underway, Japan with a two set to one lead have the serve oh what terrific defending by japan to extend this point clever play desperate dive once again and once more japan bump it over from the libero and the point has gone to japan well that will give them so much confidence because they were stretched all over the court and it's bulgaria who looked just a little bit despondent at the conclusion of that mega rally. Look at that for a save from Sato. And then the attempted set hitting the barber pole from Nasia Dimitrova. Got 
An unforced error on the serve. Sees Bulgaria tie things up at one point apiece. Bulgaria with the early lead. What a save. And a point put away to see Bulgaria continue their strong start to this third this third set this fourth set excuse me three consecutive points ask of a serving oh my goodness what a dig by Kobata and another terrific save, this time from Sato, but she didn't get a clean contact. In fact, it's a double contact ruled by the referee. And it's Bulgaria. Four unanswered points they've posted. Sato with a terrific effort. But ultimately in vain. Oh, and Bulgaria have got the bit between their teeth now. They have put together a run of five unanswered points after conceding the opening point. And unsurprisingly, Japan electing to call timeout. Kumi Nakada wanting to discuss things with her athletes. As Japan look to close this one out in four sets and not be forced to the five set distance. So Pascova with nine points in the match so far, but a service error sees Bulgaria's run of consecutive points come to an end at five. And Japan take the serve. So not executed as Bulgaria would have liked on that attempted spike. Point to Japan. Oh, that is sensational at the net. Really potent put away. Hung up in the air. And now Sia Dimitrova with a rapid arm. Rockets that one down. So this time, it is Gargana Dimitrova who comes up with the point. Advantage is four now, equaling their largest lead of the game. Well, the block out of bounds to 
to see Japan take the point and close to within three points. Japan being stretched all over the court, but they still managed to keep the ball in play. And... And they come away with the point. That is extraordinary. My goodness, Japan. Well, we highlighted the defensive prowess earlier on in this match, and no better demonstration of it than during the course of this point on the receiving end of a serious bout of sustained pressure from Bulgaria, but they hung in there. Look at the reflexes, look at the reactions, and then the control to get it over and ask the question of Bulgaria time and time again. And ultimately, the attempt to touch Spike was placed out of bounds. So it's Bulgaria who take the point after that lung-busting effort from Japan. Technical timeout has been reached with Bulgaria leading by three after a terrific start by them, which after conceding the opening point, they rattled off five straight points to give themselves Commanding position on the scoreboard, but it's still early days, of course. And Japan will take great encouragement from the dogged defensiveness that they've been demonstrating. Once again, Japan demonstrating their defensive ability, but there's no returning that one. Mira Todorova generating terrific speed on that spike. Watch her body position here. An example of the fantastic defending. So Bulgaria equaling their largest advantage of the game. And it's prompted Japan to call timeout. Excuse me, it is Bulgaria's largest lead of the game. And that prompts Japan to call timeout to ensure that they don't run too far out of sight. So Karakashiva preparing to serve. Six points in the game so far, coming in all categories, including an ace and a pair of blocks as well. Oh, 
very clever play. Gargana Dimitrova all smiles because she outfoxed the Japanese front line there. Saw with the defenders, placed their hands and put the volleyball where those hands weren't. Six points to lead now. Oh, and once again, Bulgaria breaching the Japanese defences with deft touches. Seven points. And it's a run of five points without reply. But that is brought to an end by that put away by Nabea. The point has been awarded to Bulgaria, to Japan. <laughs> so Bulgaria requesting a challenge after that point was awarded in favor of Japan is the ball in or out or is it a net chat that you're challenging There's confirmation of the fault. The foot of Mira Todorova making contact with the net. She was coming back down to earth. That not permitted, of course. So Japan reduced what was a seven point advantage back to five, make it four. They have just rattled off their third point without reply to edge ever closer to parity in this fourth set. A set where they will be looking to close it out. Oh, terrific play. The spike deep and deftly placed from Austinite. And despite the efforts of Marco Kabat, despite the efforts of Jana Todorova, unable to reel it in. Bulgaria have called timeout. So Ishi with the serve. Oh, that is wonderful hitting. Deep and driven forcefully. By Mira Todorova. Both Japan to four. Straight points comes to an end. But Japan recover the serve. Arsenai with the point. Second leading scorer for her team. Thirteen points in the match now. Well, 
Amira Todorova with another clean kill to her stat score. 13 points in the game now on that, her ninth spike of the match. Point winning spike to put her team up by four. And that spike from Yuri Nabea. See Japan recover serve and reduce the arrears to three. Bulgaria two points away from bringing about a technical timeout. Oh, but a service error. And in the context of this match, well, indeed, any high-level volleyball match, those unforced errors, what teams are looking to minimize. So Barakova with this serve. Terrific reach by Gagana Dimitrova. Nice save by the Libro. It's gone over on the first contact. Japan will have time to set up their attack. Wonderful diving save by Kobata. And ultimately, the point has gone in Bulgaria's favor. And they arrive at the second technical timeout with a five point advantage. Barta with a fantastic save. Well, that's tonight from Japan is her team's second leading scorer with 15 points so far. And here's an example of how she has powered them up. Some terrific striking. And boy, do her team need her now to close the gap. As we enter the final third of this fourth set and right on cue. She comes up, or Japan come up, with a big play to recover the serve. Well, it was a fantastic serve. Really put Bulgaria under pressure with the reception, which came back over on the first contact. Arsenai. Preparing another rocket on the jump spike serve. Oh, that is a wonderful put away. Askova preparing to serve. Bulgaria leading by four. On the bay, I couldn't control the block that was... the dig that was rifled in her direction from Gurgana Dimitrova. No chance for Iwasaka to reel that one in. It's a five-point advantage. Bulgaria's largest lead has been seven.
Well, beyond the 16 point timeout, Japan started strongly by taking the next two points, but what a response from Bulgaria. Racing out to a six point lead after three points without reply. So Bulgaria really needs some sustained success. On the serve of Iwasaka now. Oh, wonderful anticipation at the net. Pouncing on that. Dig that was just floated gently high above the net. Almost as though it was practiced. Rather than the closing stages of this fourth set. Oh, a monster block, but it's the, the point in favor of Japan. A backcourt spike set up. Not enough penetration from Gergana Dimitrova. Well, we mentioned the fact that Japan are determined competitors. How they want a run of success now. They continue to chip away point by point to mount the pressure on Bulgaria. Bulgaria will be desperate to rest the point back. How about that for a tandem at the net to produce that point winning block? Ishii and Okamura combining wonderfully. And it was Ishii who came up with the decisive touch. Her team's leading scorer, bringing her team back to within three. Trailed by six at 19-13, but since that juncture, have outscored Bulgaria 4-1. Bulgaria will be determined to make an advantage that was as large as seven in the earlier stages of this fourth set count. But it's Bulgaria. We're on the receiving end of this head of steam that has been built up, built up by Japan at the moment. A flat serve. And then another towering block at the net. Okamura right on the spot. In combination with Nabea. And it was indeed Okamura who got the decisive touch to bring her team back to within two. And the run of su success, successive points that Japan required on the Seki serve is coming to fruition. And there's another one. So Bulgaria have seen a six-point advantage be whittled down to one. Japan with five unanswered points. And make it parity now. Six straight points rattled off by Japan have tied things up at 20 points apiece deep into this fourth set. Japan will be keen to close it out and make it the deciding set and build on the two set to one advantage that they have. Wonderful dig by Ishii. Oh, and the ball landing in bounds on that fantastic block from Bulgaria. How timely is that? for Bulgaria to stop the run of unanswered points at six and edge ahead by just one at 20 points against 21. Their tandem at the net proving an unbreachable barrier. And then the ball just curving beyond the sideline now. 
on the attempted kill from the Bayer. Now, which way has the point been awarded? It's gone to Bulgaria as they inch towards the 25 point total in this fourth set, looking to force a deciding set. But Japan recover the serve, reduce the gap to just two. But the next point for Bulgaria, remember, will be set point. Nabea with a clean kill at the net. And an error on the attempted spike from Gargana Dimitrova could only trickle into the net. Japan back to within one. Terrific action here at the Monbat Arena. Absolutely nothing between these two teams during the course of what has been a terrific set so far. Japan trailed by as many as seven at 12-5, then by six at 19-13, but fought their way back. And the block has landed in bound to see them tied up once again at 23 points apiece. Soaring high was a pair of red-shirted blockers. And it brings about frustration among the fans up in the stands here. It's Ishii, Japan's leading scorer with 19 points in the match to lead all scorers who has an opportunity to bring up match points. 23 points apiece here. Terrific save in the backcourt, and then the ball has gone. <laughs> to see the point in favour of Japan to bring up match points. A terrific rally where there were some fantastic dives producing point-saving plays from both teams. Look at Gagana Dimit Dimitrov get down on the court. So too did Seki, but ultimately the final set was hammered home inside the sidelines by Nabea. Her third point of the match and the most crucial point she has scored. Ivan Petkov, the Bulgarian, Bulgarian coach, asking for a deflection, but nothing doing. Match points for Japan. Ishii with the serve. Terrific save by Ishii. And Nabea rises up high to produce the point-winning spike and conclude this match in four sets for Japan. What a terrific match we've just witnessed. Nabea has come to the fore with the final two points of this fourth set to close out what has been a thrilling match in Pool 2 between Bulgaria, the VNL debutants, and Japan the sixth ranked team in the world. It was an absolutely fantastic match. And it's been concluded in four sets after Japan took the fourth set by a